Hello, hi, how are you? And happy Sunday. Welcome to the new video. We are out today. Um, uh, not for them, it isn't. Um, and we're going to the store, and this is where we're going. It's like essentially if Walmart and Lowe's had a baby. Something, something along those lines. And you can see what I mean already by when we walk in and they have like random food and other junk stuff, but then they also have like lights and hardware and home goods stuff. And then there's like groceries back around the corner. And in typical fashion for our family, we forgot something in the car and had to go back and get it. Which were paint swabs, because that's why we're here today. We're repainting the one wall in our house because it's still got some of the plaster fixes on it from when we originally bought the house. So we have to finally fix those. It's been about two years, so it's probably about time. I think at some point my brother said something about getting these for behind our stove. This would actually probably work really well. This color and everything. I don't know, this one might too. But I don't know. I don't know if that's still a thought of his, but it would look nice. I had to walk back and get a cart because we're going to have to get three gallons. But this is what I was talking about when I mean like they have more than just hardware stuff. Like they got like some magazines and movies and other random crap like that. And they also have like a mini grocery section and pet section and stuff like that. So that's cool too. And that's the thing that just mixed the paint up for it. She just put it right in and shook it up a bunch and, and now we got paint. Well, I should say the, the color of paint because it was already paint just as the color. Now this happened when we were at Costco yesterday and we're at Menards now and uh... Yeah. October isn't even start until tomorrow so so yeah you know what 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 better time to get a tree before we even experience not one major holiday but two major holidays in America so that's fun so you know what that's what we're gonna do we're gonna take advantage of this and probably get a new tree if we can so let's do it let's uh, that one Yeah, probably not. You're right. I think we found our tree, guys. I think this might be the one. That's not the price of it, by the way. Don't get confused by that. That's for the, the Santa. It looks like there might have been something sitting there, but... Yeah. So we had one similar to that. Not that big, but uh, a lot of the lights were going out on it because it was really old, so... Getting a new one. Nice. Santa's working hard already. It's not even Christmas yet. Not even October yet. Look how hard he's working. He also cost $90 for anyone that was curious. If only Christmas still cost about $90. That would, that would be pretty nice. Now we're currently in discussion about Dilemma about it. Because we want the LED lights. Not this tree specifically. There's one over there that's an LED. But it's only a 7 foot. Whereas this one's an 8 foot and it's just fuller. But it's not LED light, so it's not going to be as bright as the issue. And that one this is a nice tree, it's just not nearly as full. And we have a bigger space, we have high ceilings. So that one would just look better in the spot of it. So, frustration, what do we do? Uh, yeah. And coming out of the arts, there's a little hot dog stand called Heavenly Hot Dogs. And they do that every day as far as I know. It's 11 to 6 I think it said. Sorry that was a semi-awkward shot. I was trying not to get hit by a car so that's where I'm at and now we're going home and I'm gonna eat some lunch. Don't know what but it'll be tasty. Lunch was tasty. Just had a couple corn dogs and some popcorn and a drink so not really anything fun to show you but now having seasonal favorite pumpkin pie on our uh yeah Fun placemats. I couldn't think of the name of this. But yeah, it's gonna be good. This is the tree we ended up getting uh, also that I forgot to mention earlier. Um, we went with the one that wasn't LED because this one will fill the space better. So yeah, um, it'll be good. It'll be good. I can't wait for Christmas. Favorite time of year. Halloween close second, but it'll be nice to be able to put you up. Later now here with Michael and Nick and SK are back there and we're going to Jungle Gyms because I haven't done this yet on the vlog and it's gonna be fun because I also haven't been here in like five years 
so fun times. And we are here. It's overwhelming, but we'll we'll tackle it. It'll be fun. Look at that guy. Swinging to soon. And it's the main attraction. Yeah, they it's different at like every time. They occasionally will like cut it up and sell it. That weighs 762 pounds of just cheese. And SK is in heaven. But they have samples. They have samples. <laughs> they have a beer tasting bar, which is pretty neat. And then a lot of wine, which is also like six more aisles back that way. This, yeah, yeah, we do. But that's where all the fancy bottles are too. Find the glass in there. These are the bathrooms. Just porta potties, but they open up into something bigger. And they also like have news stations just continuously playing clips about their bathrooms. Interesting. And next to the bathroom, pinball machines. Look at all the Pez. Like the one that's like People still collect these too. I know, and some of the the original ones are like hundreds of dollars, if not thousands of dollars. The rarest yeah, is like is like thirty thousand dollars. I didn't even notice this guy at first. He's Elvis Bear. I wonder if he works. Yeah. Oh no. It's uh, apparently it's a lion and it turns on every five minutes. So let's see what happens. Careful. Might bite. I think I'll bite it before it bites me. Waiting. Also, I just realized how creepy this, this kind of is. It's like Five Nights at Freddy's just in front of me. We're probably going to die. Elvis, you want to save us? Oh, I love the vintage wrappers for Tootsie Roll. It's just a big Tootsie Roll. Please. Three ounce Tootsie Roll. Usually you only see them like in the small ones or like the, what, three inch ones? Those are cool. And some Charleston shoes. There's so much candy. Jeez. At least some elaborate hip thrusting. I think this animatronic has seen some better days. Maybe it's like broken or... I just like... I want to point out that this is people's actual grocery store. And there's just a, a General Mills band on a boat. It's the yeah, boat from Gilligan's Island. In interesting. It just keeps going. This is all the produce, and then there's more around that corner. The derpiest looking bar. Hey, all of the like the bug things here. Oh, why? Who eats these on a regular basis? If you've had these, let me know. I heard they just taste like salt, but but it, yeah, that's uh, kind of disturbing. The seafood section, as indicated by the dock and stores above us, which I believe if you look up at some of them. Uh, some of them are just offices, which is really cool. I don't think there are any up here, those just look like facades, but but some of them, there looks like there might be an office in the top part of that boat, which is really cool. I don't think you can see any over there, but I think there are more over that way too. Fun fact, we just dropped anchor in the middle of the uh, grocery store. Who was it? Oh, it was this little guy. That might be overkill. My favorite YouTubers, are actually a couple of my favorite YouTubers, tried this a while ago and it's supposedly really good so I think I'm gonna buy this and give this a try because it's supposed to be amazing. Look at this fun bridge. Just over we're in what what would you call this? World's market esque thing now? Like this is the mid eastern of Europe. So we're in the Italian section. No, that's mid, like the Middle East Isle. Oh that makes more sense. Yeah, the little Ireland outcove now, and they have Tato brand of chips, which is basically their version of Lay's. 
but this this just kind of threw me off. It's called the Big Bag, and it's the size of a normal bag in America. So that proves something. But look at all those. those oh man, I could spend hours in here and waste all my money. Well, not waste, but you know what I mean. And they have a movie theater in here as well that tells you the story of Jungle Gyms, which is really cool. Sponsored by Kraft. So we're in the, uh, what's it called? Um, I can't think of the international aisles now and just extremely overwhelmed because all of the things that aren't American and things that we can't usually get in like regular grocery stores. So I just like need all of it. And we're running out of room with hands because we were dumb and didn't get a cart. So how you feeling, Michael? Great. Yeah. Okay, so little known fact about me, I really, really love England and Ireland and really want to travel there someday soon. So the fact that I can come to this place, Jungle Gyms, and get it's, uh, some of their wares, like uh, their potato chips, which is, seems like a really like minuscule thing, but it's just, I just, it's, it's like uh, it's healing my soul, really, but that's just, that's my uh, two cents, I guess. Yeah. 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 Oh, this stuff haunts me. I've never tried it, but all the videos I've watched of people eating this, apparently, uh... I've heard it's great. I've, you see, I've, apparently, in Australia, they don't have peanut butter, they have that. And they put that on sandwiches instead. So... I want to try it, but, like, I, I want a smaller container. Exactly. Oh, well, you know, yeah, that, okay, so this also, one's four ninety nine. Those, that one was $8.99. Yeah. That's still kind of expensive, but That's still kind of worth it. That's less expensive than that, but like, also like, I only want like, enough for one piece of bread. Not, yeah. Try. Maybe I just need to go to Australia. I wish I could hold the camera better and actually <laughs> point it at your face. <laughs> Nick is having a casual meltdown right now because of all the cutlery that's They're... around. Look at all the knives. They're cut. You think you'll make it through, Nick? No. Pray for Nick. So our, our, What's up? <laughs> uh, press F and uh, what is that? pay respects in chat. That? Why would anyone need this? It's for like a. I don't know what it's for. I it's, was gonna. I was gonna. Scrambled eggs. It's paella for paella, obviously. 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 That's that looks like a sled that you would <laughs> race down a hill. <laughs> That's a good fifty pounds at least. <laughs> Found a section I think my grandma would really like. I don't know. Do any of these look familiar? Did G Gramps ever have any of these for you? It's pretty awesome. And it's right next to the hot sauce section, which is indicated by this fire truck, which is also very awesome. I'm not quite sure that they're made out of honey. I'm pretty sure it's like corn. Okay. Until next time, Jungle Gyms. And I think I... Classic vlog stuff. Yeah, classic <laughs> vlog stuff. And I definitely got an idea for another video, which I had a while ago, but it's just not done yet. So we're gonna do that eventually. But for now, we're not. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, moment of truth. Let's see how, how this tastes. It's really good. It's really good. My heart's happy. It's this. If anyone wants to try it. Jackson, what is it? Jackson Hole Soda. Tuckleberry. Good. I recommend. Cheers. And now we end our night with some barbecue chicken pizza from California Pizza Kitchen, which I believe is a... I don't actually know. I was going to say it's a Cleveland chain, but obviously it's not because it's in the name. 
but yeah, it's a big chain um, pizza restaurant. They sell these at grocery stores. This is very tasty, and I rec recommend it. But that's going to be it for me tonight. Uh, after I eat, I'm going to go over to Nick's house, and we're going to watch a movie. Um, so obviously I won't be filming during that. But I want to say thank you guys so much uh, for watching and supporting and everything like that. If you're not already subscribed, if you go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below. If you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If not, let me know in the comments what I can do to improve. If you don't have the, the bell rung, what was that? <laughs> go ahead and ring that bell. Um, and you'll get all the notifications for when I post, which is typically every Sunday. Um, next Sunday, I believe, we're going to try to go to a place, or next weekend, most likely Sunday. So that video either might come out late Sunday or, oh, excuse me, or it might come out uh, Monday at some point during the day. Um, I Obviously, you'll know when it does. I wish I had, I don't have Twitter. Um, and I don't feel like getting Twitter back yet. I might later. Let me know down uh, if that's what you would prefer. That way I could obviously easily tweet out to you guys whether or not I will be posting that day. But yes, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, and I hope you had a good one. And have a good one. And thank you. And see you in the next one. <laughs>